Well, 1,000 Island Kings and Friends turned out in full on Friday night for the 150th anniversary gala ball at the Sheridan Cable Beach Resort. It was one of the highlights of the year-long celebrations of the 150th anniversary, bringing a number of bishops and clergy from throughout the world to Nassau for the celebration. A handsome check representing profit in the amount of $70,000 was presented to Bishop of the Anglican Diocese of the Bahamas and Turks and Caicos Islands, the Right Reverend Leish Boyd from the Anglican Ball Committee. Bishop Boyd, the third Bahamian Bishop of the Diocese, thanked the group and reflected on the Anglican Church's rich history. 150 years is a tremendous accomplishment. No one event, no one medium is sufficient to symbolize or to express the gratitude that we feel as a diocese. God has blessed us tremendously. God has allowed us to do many wonderful things. God has changed our lives as members of his church. And all through the 300 plus year history, God has allowed this church to be a life changer. The Archbishop of the Province of the West Indies, the Most Reverend Dr. John Holder, also noting the contributions of the Anglican Church to the development of the Caribbean region. I think it's a time to reflect on the great contribution the Anglican Church has made to the development of this part of the world. For many, many centuries, the church has been here proclaiming the good news and being involved in those developmental projects like education and health that emphasize the important Anglican understanding of life. That life is not only about Sunday and worship, it is also about Monday to Saturday and about all those social events in which we are involved in the course of the week. 